This is a brief presentation on how you can use EHR Tutor to enhance your classroom experience for nursing and allied health students. One thing that happens when people look at academic electronic health record systems is oftentimes they're buying a product to use in their simulation or their clinical settings. And one thing that we always talk about is when you've already paid for a system, the best thing you can do is use it as much as possible. So if you do have a product, it's great to incorporate into your classrooms as well. With EHR Tutor, one of the best things about it is you have a hospital full of patients. So any discussion that you have in your classroom where you're talking about a patient scenario or you're talking about what happens in a certain situation, we have pre-built patient charts that you can always pull up. So if you pull up one of our patient charts during a lecture or a discussion, you're really bringing that patient into your classroom. When we talk to instructors, something that happens when students go to clinical sites is that certain students will have great patient examples, but you can't bring that patient back to the classroom for everyone to have that experience. So only a few of your students will get those really great patients that they work with. However, when you have these pre-built scenarios or if you build your own scenarios in here, you always have those great patients so you can use them in the classroom whenever you'd like to do so. The other good thing about these patients is once you do use them in the classroom, you can pull them up and project any of these scenarios on a projector or a smart board. You can also have your students open up these patients during discussions. And it's a great way to increase critical thinking skills because when you open up one of these patients, you really have the patient in front of you. So if you were doing an anatomy and physiology class and you had learned about the respiratory system or any of the other systems and you had talked about the normal functionality and how things work, you can pull up the lab results on a patient and talk about are they normal, what's happening when they're not normal, and what's going on there. You can also do things like instead of having a medical math problem on a sheet of paper, you can go into the orders section and actually show real medical math involving orders so they're used to looking at it in that format. So there are a lot of different things you can do here when you have a chart. The other thing about our site in particular is we do have a free polling feature. So if you're a customer of ours, you can use our polling feature. It's a very simplistic survey system. So instead of using one of the complicated or expensive clicker systems out there, your students can use any device with internet access, whether it's a smartphone, a laptop, or a computer in the classroom. They pull it up, and if you as an instructor ask a question, so if you did have a patient chart up, and let's say your students had already learned about hygiene, so they learned about the temperature of the water and how to properly bathe a patient, they already knew all of that. They also had already learned all about your vital signs. So let's say you popped up a patient chart and you showed a list of vital signs and it was a pneumonia patient. And let's say she had very, very low blood pressure or she was having some other issues when you looked at her vital signs, her oxygen levels were off, things like that. If you were to show that during a discussion, you could ask your students, if this patient wants to get up to take a bath, should we let her do that, yes or no? And when you ask that question with our polling feature, your students would see it pop up on their screen so they can click on yes or they can click on no. If they do that, you'll see on your screen, so you can put this up on a projector or smart board so everybody can see it, you'll see those, answered or those answers will be tallied. And that's a really good way to gauge students' understanding during a discussion and also encourage classroom participation. So those are just a few ways that you can use our site in your classroom. If you would like more information on our product, you can call us anytime at 440-305-6188. You can also check out our website at ehrtutor.com. If you do reach out to us, one thing we can always do for you is set up a quick demo where one of our sales representatives will show you the actual site and talk about some more teaching ideas. You can also visit our website to find a short video like this on ideas for your lab setting and also clinical rotations. If you have any questions at all, reach out to us at any time. You can also email us at information at ehrtutor.com.